Hey guys, Brandon Woolen with CCM Magazine here at the 45th ASCAP Christian Music Awards celebration with a guy who's been here a lot of times, Ben Glover. How are you today, man? Hey man, I'm good. I'm good. I'm doing good. Yeah, so over 400 ish songs written, uh, Song of the Year awards here. How do you keep writing these songs, coming up with new ideas? I mean, that's a lot of songs. How, do, how are all these ideas in your head that come out into these <laughs> lyrics? Man, you know, it's one of those things where you just, I think I had a friend uh, years ago who said, you have, to, you have to live to write. So, you know, I, that's what I do. I write songs. So I, I, I live life, try to pay attention, and come up with ideas along the way and go, hey, that might be a song, that might be a song. You're thinking, it's always in your head. Well, you're watching a movie, we're watching, talking to a, a friend in a conversation. It could be anything, you know, and it's just, they come from all over the place. <laughs> We just got done talking with Matthew West. He kind of was the opposite of you. He was behind the scenes just writing songs, and then he went on tour, and now he's, I told him he's going to be the Bill Gaither. He's going to be like 85 years old, still right. songwriting and touring. You were kind of the opposite. You started as an artist, and now you're off the road and just in songwriting sessions every day. Yeah, was, yeah. was that a hard transition when it happened to pull yourself off the road and, and write songs for other no. people? Man, that was so, believe it or not, that was so long ago that I've almost forgotten that it happened. Because I started in like, I won't even say before the year. YouTube, so there's not even videos yes. of you performing out there. Nobody which would even believe fine, it now. Which is fine. I had about a five-minute artist career, and I thought that's what you're supposed to do. You yeah. come in, you be an artist. That's great. I, yeah, like I said, about five minutes. The last I think I have one single that, but maybe kind of worked a little bit, and then all of a sudden I find myself. I mean just well hey it's not gonna work and then and then so people start calling me for songs I mean this is years ago and then I I just fell into that and, and liked it more yeah. than so uh, God kind of made the decision for you you didn't yeah, make it for yourself. yeah I mean really that was the case yeah. I just that was where I was meant to be the whole time and people have asked me through the years and it's been it's been a lot <laughs> of years at this point but they've asked me like hey do you do you re do you regret not that not working or do you wish you could go back and I was like no and and I mean it. Like I'm happier behind the scenes than I am in front. Like I that I watch a guy like Matt, and you know I've known Matt. Matthew was honestly my first co-write. Wow. Probably over 20 years ago. So you know I mean I'd look back. I go look at what he's done, and I go, what he does on stage is something is a gift that that I that I yeah. don't have. That's I don't thing. have it either. And I'm, you know, that's great. I watch him do it. And I'm like, you're great at that. Like, you are great at, like, he hosts the K-Love Awards. He does, he's awesome. Yeah. And so for me, I'm like, I'll sit behind a mixed desk. I'm good. That's fine. A couple years ago, he even <laughs> wore the short pink shorts at the K-Love Awards. Somehow they talked him into that. Did you ever get to see that clip? <laughs> um, no. Maybe don't not. look that one up. That was a, <laughs> right. a surprise Matthew gave everybody. Yeah. That night. That's awesome. All right, well, good hanging out with you, man. Uh, tonight, minutes. all about songwriting here. 45th annual ASCAP Christian Music Awards. A celebration. Let's go have some fun. Awesome.